In this video, I will show you how to use the insulin pen. So here I have a box of insulin pen. The first thing you need to look at is the expiration date to make sure the insulin is not expired. And you should always store the insulin in the fridge, but not in the freezer. Once you start to use the pen, then you should keep it in the room temperature and toss it in 28 days. Okay, so let's open the box. You see there is a pan and there are also many needles inside the smaller box. The first thing you need to do is to remove the cap and look at the liquid part. Make sure this is clear. If the disk is cloudy, you cannot use the insulin. The next step, we'll need to put the needle on. Get a needle from the box. And you can see the needle is inside. So push the needle onto the top of the pin. And screw it in. Okay, so now we can remove the needle cap and the inner cap. Now you can see the needle. The next step is to prime the pen. When I say prime, I mean to squeeze the air out of the pen so you don't inject air into your muscle. The way we prime the pen is by dialing the pen to two units and then put the pen upright tap on it a few times so the gas will accumulate onto the top then squeeze it squeeze the button you will see there will be liquid coming out so the gas is squeezed out and then we can dial to the units, the dose that you need. Let's say we're going to have 12 units. So I'll dial to 12. And then, in order to save myself another injection, I will just inject it on this paper towel. So you, you can inject in your belly, upper arm, thigh, or hip. Push the needle in and press the button all the way down. The pan should stay there for 5 seconds to make sure all the insulin comes in. Then you can remove the pen. And remember, you should rotate your injection site every time so that your skin does not get hard or thickened because if that happens, the insulin will not be absorbed. So always rotate your injection site every time. Now I will put the cap back on. and remove the needle and put the cap back on. That's it.